after weeks of testimony, jurors in the Carl Thompson excessive force trial are finally getting to hear from Officer Thompson on the tr in this trial. Well, today Thompson took the stand in his own defense. He detailed how and why he used baton strikes and a taser on Otto Zim. KXOY 4's Jeff Humphrey joins us now live at the Federal Building where some of Thompson's fellow officers were watching his testimony on closed circuit TV. And Jeff, the defense doesn't want the jury to think that Thompson lied to investigators. And Nadine, that's because, oddly enough, Carl Thompson could spend more time in prison if he's convicted of lying to investigators than violating Otto Zem civil rights. And so the first question that he was asked today was whether Carl Thompson had ever told anyone that Otto Zem had lunged at him with a pop bottle. Carl Thompson answered no, sir, and said the first time he heard the word lunged associated with the case is when Assistant Chief Jim Nix said lunge in a television interview. Thompson testified as soon as he heard about the TV report, he called the lead investigator in the case and asked her to correct the chief's statement to the media. Also today, Thompson told the jury that when he first contacted Zem at the zip trip, dispatchers had confirmed that Zem had stolen someone's money and that Thompson wanted to detain Zem inside the store before he tried to escape by running through dangerous Division Street traffic. Thompson says when he commanded Zem to drop the soda bottle he was holding, Zem said why and then no. Thompson said he did hit Zem with a baton in the hopes of getting him on the ground and then tasered Zem so he could get him in handcuffs. And Thompson went on to tell the jury this afternoon that Otto Zem actually was kicking and punching at the officer, that he felt blows against his chest. But under cross-examination, prosecutors asked Thompson to show the jury where on that surveillance video all that kicking and punching had occurred, and it simply was not visible on the recording. Thompson back on the stand for the defense tomorrow. We now understand this jury not going to, excuse me, the trial, not really going to the jurors until sometime next week in Yakima. Reporting live downtown, Jeff Humphrey, KXLY4.